Hello and welcome back to the colony with Man of the Ants playing some more transference today. Very exciting stuff. Got a little bit stuck last time, but both Scott and Andy very helpfully commented on the video and pointed out where I was going wrong. They also called me an idiot. I mean, they didn't say the word idiot, but it was, you know, the implication was there. So there is a hourglass. I was going to call it a sand timer. That's not a thing. There's an hourglass in the front room we need to fix. There's apparently some sand in the boys' bedroom that I missed. Not sure if it's in this. No, it's going to be in the other. I said it's in the dream-like reality. So we need to go and flick the time over, I believe. So we'll go on oh, the light, light time, the light switch over. So we shall go and do that. This is also the first record and the first time I have used with my new VR cover facial interface on my Rift which is actually very wonderful. I picked it up purely because I have someone coming around to just have a go on the Rift next week on Tuesday. And uh, I looked at my Rift and I thought, ooh, after several hundred hours, San Francisco beach sand, yes, there we go. After several hundred hours of uh, VR in the headset, my interface, the little phone bit, was starting to get a little bit raggedy just soaked and caked in sweat and the such like and a little bit unpleasant so I thought I would not force my friend to have to endure that thought I would do the nice thing and get something that's a bit more comfortable and a little bit less you know disgusting for him to my fucking dog well that caught me off guard I wasn't expecting that because we uh, obviously did both of the um we're going to call them worlds the light switch on and off and explored the whole place and that didn't happen so i wasn't expecting anything new to happen till after i'd put the sand in obviously that's not the case stuff is happening i'm now a lot more on edge than i was at the start of the video if i can just get if i can just get a little more time. Oh. So now we can flick this over and we'll have all the time in the world to go over here and do what? What? No, that doesn't seem right. Ah, but now we made it over there, I see. Right, now we're over in this area. That's what we actually needed to do. So there is a thing here. Dickory, dickory, dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one, and down he run. Hickory, dickory, dock. That's a good one. That's good. <laughs> That's good. Here's another. Go on. Mother Hubbard went to the cupboard to give the poor dog a bone. But when she came there, the cupboard was bare, and so the poor dog had none. Oh, poor little doggy. She went to the baker's to buy him some bread. But when she came back, the dog was dead. <laughs> Why did she buy the dog bread? Dogs don't eat bread. Best for last. Oh, I don't like it. Something's going to happen. Now I lay me down to sleep. I pray the Lord of my soul to keep. Guide me safely through the night. Wake me with the morning light. Amen. Okay, that's so far so good. So far so good. Amen. Hmm. That's it? Oh, nothing happened. So what else can we do over here? Anything in that drawer? No, not that. No, we can't access the drawer. It's got to be something else. Sure. Ah. So what time do we set it to? All the clocks seem to be at different times, don't they? That's like, yeah. Just past eight. That's just before eight. So maybe not. But we just keep turning it until something happens. Or it's expecting us to know what time to put it to. Which does seem to be the case, doesn't it? Oh. Okay, we have fixed the front room. Ben, 
Hello. It's the crystal restore. Sound. Yep. Process through a prism. We've been through this. Through a prism in case is the answer that we've been. It was right there in front of us the entire time. All it took was the willingness to see it. Uh huh. And to use it as miles to go before I sleep. Well, I'm not a big fan of that opening on its own. I don't think the doors have ever opened on their own before. That's a new one. So now, this USB stick that was there before, we couldn't... Uh... I wish we would just let you play it directly from that. Let's have a look, see if we can figure out which one it is. Oh, I think it's one of these four, isn't it? Is it this one? Professor Raymond Hayes here, checking in on the date, November 11th of 2011. I don't think it is, is it? science going around here, just sciencing up the... Nope, not that one. In fact, if it's not that one, it's not going to be... So maybe this one? My little horse must think it queer to stop without a farmhouse near. Well, I'm not sure. Between the woods... There's lots of weird poems. The darkest evening of the year. I thought there was only three groups there before, but maybe I was wrong. Our instincts were correct. They brought us along a parallel path. The temperature was not the condition itself, it was the conditional result. Hmm. Familiar. It's the crystals. Sound... ...can be processed. We've definitely seen that sort of thing a few times. Let's just check these quickly. Uh, now we've seen that one. We've seen the last one. So it must have just been that crystal one again, but just in a... ...end menu end in a menu format you can watch it at any moment now okay let's carry on with the creepy you have one new message all right okay Can you be drenched in tears? How many do you need to cry to be drenched in tears? Those are very different things. What is the music of absence? Interesting question. Silent applause, in case you couldn't tell. What is this? Not that's a good question. That's another good question. When will it? Oh, that's the last crystal. Oh, that's the last crystal. Ha 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 ha. So is the wife somewhere entirely different? Is she in a different parallel universe? One composed purely of sound, perhaps, because there's nothing else there. There's just silence. Let's have a look at this while we are... Oh, it's a power bill. I mean, his power bill must be extreme. The amount of stuff that they have. Look, I mean, look at that. Look at that. How much power does that take? Just what? One, two, three, four, five, six... Seven, about, eight, about eight full racks of equipment. And that's just in that room. They're all over the place. Does this just go on forever now? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Not a fan of the immediate chain. Nope. Changing music. Oh, it's gonna make me go around. Oh, the Shadow Man isn't... Well, hang on. No, that doesn't make any sense. How can I get to the machine if... Let 
unless I go through the front room. Is that the only door that isn't shaking at me? Nope, that one's shaking as well. Okay. Well, that only leaves two doors then, doesn't it? Nope, it leaves one door because the other one has disappeared. And that doesn't open either. Ah, oh, there's the light switches appeared there, look. Okay. Of all the things I don't want to do, that is really, really strongly one of them. Oh my lord! Okay. I'm fine. That's fine. What's up, mate? What's up? Everything, everything good? Just want to see if he does anything, or if he just disappears, just disappears. Okay. Okay. And now we're going to be transported back to the basement. Okay. 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 It's done. A bit red on your face. And they will thank me. They will thank me later. They will. They will. They will. We've seen this before as well, didn't we? Suggesting that he's uh Well the impression I got with those that he's killed his wife and tried to transfer her into this uh, alternate dimension. This is a bit different. Very uh, industrial doors. What have we got going on here? Plane ticket for Benjamin Hayes. I'm leaving you, Ray. Plane ticket for Catherine Ray. Oh, she was going to leave him. So what did he do? What did he do? It's quite nice. I mean, obviously it's creepy as hell, but I like it. Without memory. Okay. I gave up everything for him. And what did he do? He caged you like a bird. It's useless to play lullabies for those who cannot sleep. Last concert. Could not figure that out. I think she's stuck. I think you got her stuck. I think that's what happened. Oh. Please end this. Okay, well, there's only one way we can go. How are we doing time-wise? 15 minutes. Please remember. So this is definitely looking like the wife now, isn't it? So this is... She's stuck. I'm stuck. This is not real. Delete my existence. Music's kicking in. So I think it wants me to go that way, but I don't really want to do that. If I'm being entirely honest. Nothing in the headphones. You need to get out now, that place is toxic. Who's that from? Elizabeth Meadows. Obviously, her friend recommending that she maybe not stay around with her. They don't need me. Crazy, crazy husband. No one needs me. No, oh, she was invited to Boston. Is that was that the final straw? Wasn't actually expecting any other doors to work, but here we are. Reach my breaking point. I am broken. That's Elizabeth again, her friend. I once played beautiful music. I'm stuck. 
assume she was pretty big name then if she was cover of the magazine material. Hmm, can't actually... You should have my music. Namaste. Anything freaky? Good game. Good game. What happened to my music? Don't know who that's from. Groceries left on the floor. No kitchen door. Lots of marks on the wall suggesting she's been in this stuck location for a while. Ah, that's a definitely a new log we can watch. That's this one. Song Song. The same one we saw in Benjamin's room Benjamin's room before. From the salt, salt sea, all for the love of thee. It is, isn't it? Yes. Okay, we'll just skip that then. It's because we have seen it before. Does the music need to be this creepy? Why can't they have a bit of, I don't know, happy scar music on or something? Oh my Jesus Christ almighty, you son of a bitch! Ooh. Ah dear. So does that mean we can now go in that room or is that going to happen every time we open that door? Let's find out. Let's be absolutely ridiculous and find out. Is she the shadow monster? Okay. It's gonna happen every time. Ah. Ooh, and breathe. And breathe. Okay. So we need to go out the front door. That is what we've established then. Guess follow the line. Maybe not up here, because that doesn't seem to go anywhere. Let's find out what happens if we... No, we just get stuck. We're not allowed. Oh, no, we can. No, we can't. No, we can't. Okay. Down we go, then. So is that it, then? She's the shadow monster. She's stuck, and she doesn't really know what she's doing, perhaps. Or she's gone a bit mad, because she's been there for so long. Benjamin, the kid, is stuck in a slightly different different place? Is this just looping around in a circle? No, because that's a different different door. Okay. Oh, I think I got myself stuck. It's not going to let me go up anymore. Because the up has been deleted as I go down. Or is it? No. So I have to keep going down. And I kind of can't grab those. There are no light switches. So I just keep going down until something happens. Is that how it works? There's a creepy, creepy noise. It sounds like it's behind me constantly. And now the controllers are starting to vibrate. Which is not helping my sanity in the slightest. What's that? What's going on with the floor there? I don't know and I don't like it. So more marks on the wall where she's been... 
do you think of him? Music's getting creepier. Still can't get in there. More marks. Please remember. So she, I think she is the shadow creature. She's trying to keep herself sane. And this is going to be the descent into her insanity. This is what this spiral staircase represents, I think. Delete my existence. A lot more marks on the wall. Something's going to happen. It's going to scare the living crap out of me. Loss. More marks. Uh, not getting the door anymore. She's starting to be locked out of her um, her memories. That's what. I'm, that's how I'm going to read that. Not even locked out. She's forgotten that they're there. Do you think of him? More marks, more broken hearts. It can't be right. More marks. Lots more marks now. Starting to reach the end of her breaking point, I suspect. It can't be right. Please remember. It can't be right. You have too many faces. I'm back in the apartment. Boston Orchestra still. Oh, okay. Okie dokie. Well, I think that is about where I'm going to leave that. We're up to 24 minutes recorded, so almost certainly about 20 minutes of game time, which is what I'm trying to keep this series sort of pinned down to, just because I'm not sure I can handle much more. Last time was quite uneventful. Um, this time, quite a lot of things have happened, and it's definitely left me a little bit a little bit on edge, so I think I'm going to leave that there then. I'm enjoying it, I'm liking it. If I'm right in particular, I'm enjoying it. Um, and I think I might be. I kind of, it all makes sense, doesn't it? The fact that she's a shadow monster, she was locked in here for a long time. Um, the husband, whose name I can't remember, did it because she was leaving him because she was fed up with his descent into madness as a mad, insane scientist. So he tried to transfer her consciousness into a new existence. And she got stuck there and she, he couldn't communicate with her and she was there for a long, long time and eventually lost her sanity and become the shadow creature. It also explains why the shadow creature is after Ben, the kid as well, and, and where he's been put. Because obviously it's her son. She may not remember it's her son, but maybe she has some sort of vestigial need to look after this child, which is why the picture's on the wall. She's reaching for him, she's holding him. To him it's horrible because it's a monster, but to her it's her son, I guess. So that's how I'm reading it all then. That's my take. And if you have any other suggestions or ideas, let me know down below. Hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please do click the like button. Also subscribe to the channel if you've not already. That would be just wonderful, wouldn't it? Wonderful for everyone involved, I think. And if you do subscribe, do hit the little bell button as well so you do get notified about new videos as and when they come out. Don't forget we stream on Wednesdays at 6 p.m. UK time, so come along and say hello there. Otherwise, I shall see you next time in Transparence, and as always, well, <laughs> thank you very much for joining me.